Good morning, Northwestern, and welcome to our Tuesday morning message. Let's get started. Today is Tuesday, April 28th. Dear Northwestern Wildcats, good morning and happy terrific Tuesday. And as we know, terrific is a very important word in Charlotte's Web, which I hope you've been enjoying getting to read again. How has it been to be back in school after the break? Yesterday I talked a little bit about how sometimes it's hard to get back on a schedule, so maybe you're having a, kind of a challenge with that, or maybe you're just really excited to dive right, right back in. Either way is fine. Today you will do some creative writing in Lit and learn about equivalent fractions in math. What do you think equivalent fractions are? Well, you're about to find out. Remember that in lit for your writing, you will need to write at least five sentences. So if you only write like one or two sentences or even just one or two words, I will ask you to add more or to redo it. I really wanna see you being creative and thinking about what's going on with the characters in the story. I can't wait to read and look at your awesome work. Let's talk about April break reading log shout outs. So there are three people in our class who by the end of April break on Sunday had submitted multiple submissions to our reading log to tell me about the books that they'd been reading over break. And even though I'm sure everybody did lots of great stuff over break, I just want to take a moment to shout those friends out. Those three people are Brianni, Quinton, and Camille, thank you so much for submitting your awesome work to me and letting me know what you were reading over break. And I hope you really enjoyed reading those books. Shout out to those friends. Videos on assignments. So you probably have noticed that there are several assignments each week that have videos attached to them right in the forms. Please, please make sure you do not skip those videos especially in our math one, our math assignment today, there's a really important video that you need to watch to learn about equivalent fractions. And if you skip the video, you will not understand what to do on the assignment. Same goes for informational tomorrow and uh, the videos for literature assignments with teachers reading the chapters out loud are usually very helpful to help you think about the annotations that you're going to make. If you have questions about videos or need help watching them, just let me know. Finally, let's take a mindful moment. Let's do some circle breathing. Make sure your back is up straight. Your attention is focused just on your breathing and on my finger. As I make the circle going up, breathe in. As the circle goes down, breathe out. We'll do it three times. Awesome. I hope you have a terrific Tuesday, Northwestern. Love, Miss Pyatt.